Hey everyone, it's Jen Harris here, exclusive Purple Status Presenter with Unique, and I want to show you guys how to use Tiny Torch uh, to automatically schedule and automate your uh, online event party posts and your online events on Facebook. So this is a very, very helpful tool because it's going to help you cut down time that you're spending copying and pasting and reworking um, your parties every time you have them. You can have multiple parties running and have this posting in them for you. So all you have to do is follow up with the customers in the party and um, you know answer questions, comment, post anything else that you would like to. But this at least has a certain skeleton that you can create or an outline that you can post to your parties so that you don't have to remember to do it at you know 8, 10, noon, three and five or at popular times you can actually use this to schedule your posts at popular times so what you're gonna do is go to app.tinytorch.com <clears throat> and you'll have to first sign up for an account once you sign up for an account you're gonna go ahead and log in and I'm gonna show you how to set this up so over here on the left you have several different tabs these tabs are different menus within Tiny Torch and each tab is going to help you put together your template. Your template is what you're going to schedule out to your party. So there are only some tabs that we're going to look at or incorporate for scheduling our party. That's the Create tab, My Post tab, and the Templates tab. Keeping in mind that there are other features within Tiny Torch that you can use if you would like for your business, such as scheduling posts to your personal page. Today, like I said, we're going to uh, focus on scheduling it to our event. So, first, what we need to do in order to schedule things to our events is you want to have an idea of what you're going to post each day. So, for me, I have what I call um, a beauty bar that I run for uh, five days, and I post about ten times a day because it's a five day condensed format, and I want to keep everyone's interest. I post games, I post interactions, I post information about the product. Now, I will tell you there is one downside here to using Tiny Torch, and that is that you cannot post videos directly from Tiny Torch to the wall of the event. You can, however, do links. So if you have a fa uh, you YouTube channel and you upload your videos to there, you can copy and paste them and put them on um, to a post to put automated to your party and it'll give everyone the link. I prefer to have my videos directly on the party wall, so what I do is schedule everything else and all I have to take care of is when I'm actually posting a video. I'll post that from my phone. So what you want to do is after you create that outline, you are going to know that like day one is welcome and eyes maybe, day two is lips, day three is skin, For just an example. It can be whatever you want that matches your personality. Um, I don't have time today to get into all of the party tips, and I always want to do that, but I'm going to stick uh, strictly to Tiny Torch. So, what you're going to start with is creating all of your posts. So, if you go to your Create tab, here's where you're going to create one post at a time. Yes, it takes time to set this up. I'd say it took me about um, an hour and a half, but once I'm done, I'm done, and it's saving me hours of time um, in the future. So. What you can do is here's where you're going to type in your message that you want to appear. So we're going to say example post, I'm going to say day one. And you can select images by browsing if you want. And then your privacy, this privacy is just in regards to Tiny Torch. So I always set that to private for right now. And then I don't use labels right now because we're just keeping this simple. So, um, I don't even know if I have images on my computer, but yes, I do. So let's just say this is, you know, image number one for my party. So select image, example, post day one. And I'm going to create my first post. So that post is out there. And what you'll see is this tab right here, my post. That's where all of your posts are stored. So you'll see some of my actual party posts are out here too. There's Here's the one we just created. It's that picture with example post day one okay I'm not going to go into the buttons at the bottom yet because um, I'm just gonna let's create two posts so I can show you guys the example so I'm gonna go back to create and you're gonna want to put create all of your posts first so I'm just gonna use this 
and do example post to. And I set it to private. If you set it to public, that just means anyone on Tiny Torch can see it, which is probably not a bad idea in the future. Um, this is just while I'm getting used to it. So now my second one looks like this. Again, I'm just going to hit create. You're going to do that over and over again. You're going to go to create. You're going to create your post. You're going to type what you want, put in your picture that you want, and create it. And then keep going back until you have all your posts ready for all of your days, right? Once you have that done, you'll see my two posts here, you're going to go to templates. Now you'll see here, I have my template that I'm actually using. It has 33 scheduled posts. I, like I said, I do have some videos that I have to post directly to the wall that aren't automated, but that's okay with me. So what you want to do is you want to create a template. I'm just going to call this example party. What do is when we type in our title, we're going to create a template. This is our template, the example party. And what you want to do is add one of your posts. And you're going to go through and add each of your posts. So this might not be the most um, efficient to set up, but it definitely helps you in the future. So you're going to go through and add your post that you want in your party. So I'm going to add this one by clicking on it and saying add to template at the bottom here. I'm going to select the template and click done. Once it does that, I can go through all my posts, scroll down, add them to my template. Okay. Then once I do that, let's say those are the only two that I have for my party, I can go here to my party. When I click on it, it's going to bring up all my posts. And I can start at the top and just start laying out. I can just start laying out which day of the party and what time of that day I want it to post. So this one says day two. So day two. Now I I typically before I go into Tiny Torch to set up my party, I already have it outlined in Word, so I know which one goes with which day and at what time. So you want to pick popular times that people are going to view um, be on Facebook. So I might say day two at 7 p.m. You say p.m. Here's where you can put the minute. So if I want it to be 7.15 p.m., that's what I'm going to do. And I click Done. Make sure you click Save. Once I click Save, it'll be here. So make sure that pink button goes away. And then here is Day 1. Let's say we wanted to post that at 8 o'clock p.m. We'll click Save. And now that moves that to the top. So it will actually show it to you in order of what they are. And then, you know, you have to obviously go through all of your posts, put them into a day and a time slot in an organized fashion for whatever your outline was, and then you're done. It's saved. Now what you can do is schedule the template. So you can say a schedule template, and you can go to social account. Um, so I should actually take a step back here because we didn't show you how to set up your social account. So up here in this little power button, you have to go to social accounts and you have to add social accounts. It will connect your Facebook so then you can add social accounts, um, either your profile, your page, your event, or your group. So you can click here and choose event and you can scroll down through all of your available events and choose which ones to add. Make sure when you're done that you remove them so that you can add more because you can see here you can only have a certain number of social accounts. So once you add your uh, your actual party here, then you can go into your template again, go to templates and example party, and you can click schedule template. You choose which event here under social account that you want, so test, and then you put the start date, and it knows what time to start because you tell it on day one what time the first post should be posted, etc. And then you just go ahead and click schedule template and it will start posting. Let me just show you an example then. So I ran a test and you will see here I didn't post any of my man any of my manual videos or anything but I did go ahead and, and schedule but you'll see it's been running for the past couple days and has been posting for me and I just wanted to make sure you know, before I went that, that, before I went live with this, that it was working. So that's just kind of to show you 
how that works. So hopefully this is helpful. Feel free to play around on Tiny Torch. There are, you know, other shortcuts to do things. You can add a post here. It'll take you to the different areas. Um, and let me know if you have any questions. And thank you so much for watching. Good luck.